welcome to my channel tally learning world in today's video we'll discuss how to record a stat payment for tds form 26q in tally prime to record this transaction first we'll go to the report by pressing alt g under the form 26q we'll check there is amount of payable of tax it's 430 rupees to record this payment either you can use alt s as a start payment from this screen or you can just go to gateway of tally from the voucher you can go to f5 that is payment voucher and here also we have option control f for autofill so once we'll click on control f we'll get the option type of transaction as start payment so once we select as a start payment we'll select the type of tax as tds and for the month which we have directed the tax i'll just select and all my sections i'll select for which i wanted to make a payment and i'll select the nature of payment a directive type as a company we have been directed and we as residential because because 26q is a part of resident form so let's create a bank ledger under bank account and we'll press control a so as you can see the transaction is been saved so let's go to the voucher form 26q so you can see the amount is showing still as pending which is balance payable if the transaction is falling under uncertain transaction to press enter and fill the bank details in the payment voucher while creating the bank ledger we have not provided the check number so that is the reason the check number and the check date it's been not taken so let us fill this details and we'll just try to fill all the chalan details and chalan number for all the nature of payments so once i fill all these details to save this screen i'll press control e as you can see the transaction has been moved from uncertain transaction to included in returns for payment details and you can see the amount has been moved from balance payable to total amount paid for more videos subscribe to my channel tally learning world and press the bell icon for more updates and new videos